All right, I'm going to go ahead and just pause it right out the gate to explain something. What you can't see in the footage is that three to four minutes before this, I was just slowly creeping up to this spot with my trolling motor on low and my sonar turned off. The water is crystal clear and it's glass calm and those big fish spook easily. So I wanna be as stealthy as possible when approaching my target. I get my boat in position. I make my one cast at the spot knowing that that big fish has been relating to this certain spot on the toolies. I let the bait sink down for a second and then I start my retrieve. I'm gonna get bit here in a second, but I want you to pay attention how I respond. The rod shakes, I instantly reel up really fast, feel the weight of the fish, and then swing into it. I don't even realize I'm doing it anymore, I just naturally do it. I feel the rod thump, and I reel up really quick, crank, 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 feel that weight, and then lay into it. Once I'm hooked up and battling, I try and always keep my rod tip down. And in this case, I stick it about a quarter of the way in the water, just in time for that fish to come to the surface. And my rod tip is pulling it back down so that it cannot jump full body out of the water and spit the bait. That's part of the process. It's all about timing. Those fish are going to try and break the surface, but you just gotta be able to kind of predict that and take the appropriate action. Oh man, that fish was rowdy. Just watching it again right now just gives me anxiety. All the feelings, all the emotions, just reliving them. Just like, ugh. Such a relief just to have that fish in the boat. It's an 11 pound fish. It's a fish of a lifetime. I'd been through a tough couple of weeks leading up to that. So it was just such a breakthrough for me. And I was just really stoked, like honestly stoked I caught that fish that day.